Hi folks, this is all the fruit and here I have Gustavia Augusta, a plant which is in the Lecitidiaceae family or in the monkey pot family. And if you are familiar with monkey pot, you know that you can not only use them as containers, you cannot use them as cooking pots because, yeah, plant matter, it's basically a wood-like nutshell which is gonna burn. But what you can do is you can eat the seeds. Well, what are you gonna find inside the monkey pot? <clears throat> In South America, there is the so-called Brazil nut, one of the most valuable nuts, maybe the most valuable nut of South, of South America. Uh, and it is in the same family. And this Gustavia here might have been a lot smaller. Oh, before I crush the fruit, I should maybe have shot it to you. Well, they're called monkey pots because in many species, the lid will fall off and then you'll have something like a pot and the lid. You can actually even use it as a container and people do use them as a container and they make stuff like souvenirs out of them. Yeah, this one, it somehow it doesn't seem to, it doesn't seem to uh, remove its lid voluntarily. It doesn't open nicely like a monkey pot, but once you open it, it reveals the inside with the edible seeds, which are basically related to the Brazil nut. The skin of the seeds is much, is much thinner just like the pot is thinner. In the Brazil nut, this pot will be made of thick wood-like substance. And then you have another thick wood-like shell around each seed. Well, here the seed is more thin. Hmm. Hmm. The taste is very different. No. No resemblance to a Brazil nut, and it's also pretty bitter. Hmm, how exactly shall I describe it? It reminds me of something, not of cassia. It does remind me of something. Well, it's not very pleasant, to put it simple. Hmm. I wouldn't eat it, not in that state. Maybe you have to remove the shell, maybe you have to roast it or something. I don't know, but here the bitterness is dominant and the second dominant taste is some mouth-watering. Mouth-watering taste, but in a bad way, like your mouth is producing a lot of spit just to get rid of the taste. So not really present this Gustavia. I would really prefer the Brazil nuts. And then taste as I am. And the third taste component, which is much weaker, is like a Chinese date. Yeah, like a jujube. But the dominant, the dominant taste is bitterness. So I'm sorry folks, this Gustavia, I thought a nice two to three meter Monkey pot plant, the Brazil nut, it grows up to dozens and dozens of meters, gigantic trees which need decades or even centuries to produce a lot of yield. This is a small plant which produces dozens and dozens of fruit. I thought, okay, each fruit produces a dozen seeds. If they taste like Brazil nuts, they would be a viable alternative, but not in that case, folks, sorry. So. Folks, this was Gustavia Augusta, grown here on the beautiful island of Tenerife. Not the perfect nut for me. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the island of Tenerife. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.